Coronavirus has affected us all, our global community, from our world leaders to unknown sleep dwellers. All are at risk, and some people will have a better chance of survival than others. The health crisis is not distinguishing between race, social status, wealth or borders, and it's hitting vulnerable people much harder. Alarmingly, it has taken us the all-invasive presence of COVID-19 to illustrate an appalling reality. The world was ill-prepared for the pace of its spread, and little was in place to prevent it. A vaccine for COVID-19 is already being tested, and many of us will benefit. However, we need to remember we are not yet tackling the most fundamental preventive measure, safe sanitation and hygiene. Globally, more than 4 billion people do not have access to safely managed sanitation services, and 3 billion lack access to basic hand washing facilities. One in three schools and over 20% of healthcare facilities have no sanitation service, directly impacting more than 1.5 billion people. Lack of basic sanitation and hygiene in health facilities leads to poor quality care and an increased chance of infection for patients and health workers. Sepsis, now killing more people than cancer, is preventable through good hand hygiene. It's a sad reality that over 600 million children do not have basic sanitation facilities in their school. Our partners are now putting emergency funds into public health solutions to prevent the spread of COVID-19. This is welcome, and we equally need to focus on prevention. We can stop new pandemic and we can save the lives of millions of people if we invest in sanitation and hygiene now, and importantly, after COVID-19. That is why, together with partners, we are launching a new dedicated sanitation and hygiene fund. The fund will work with governments and partners to ensure that millions of families have access to toilets and hand washing at home, schools and health centers, and that girls and women have access to menstrual health and hygiene support. The sanitation and hygiene sector is critically underfunded. This is our moment to act. We call on you donors, partners, and governments to join us and support us. Together we can address this crisis and reach the people who have been left behind.